Hello everyone, welcome back to Nino Kuni, Wrath of the White Witch. Um, so, last episode I had arrived at Ara Memoriae, however the hell you pronounce that. Moriae? I don't know. A friend of mine would probably slap me for mispronouncing that because he did explain how the AE thingy ligature, I think, is pronounced. Uh, but, you know, unfortunately, I have no idea. Or, or I don't remember, would be more accurate. Okay. And what's here? Yes. Okay, so that's it, no puzzle. Well, that's disappointing. I was hoping for a puzzle. You know what? For some reason I smell a boss fight. Before I was smelling a puzzle, but now I just I just have the feeling that it's gonna be a boss fight. Yeah, it annoys me that I can just drop down from there, but whatever. Flower of Youth. And now the boss fight, I think. I, I don't remember. Okay, place is glowing, glowing. Brace yourselves. I don't hear any voice. No. All this time I have been waiting here in Nazca. Yeah, you've been waiting, got it. Time has come, my final act. Is it just straight to a boss fight? I don't think so. My solitude stretched before me, with no end in sight. All I had for company were my memories, the pieces of an ever more distant past. I tried to hold on to the happy times, hoping to keep my loneliness at bay. For how many years this continued, I cannot say. And then, one day... Can it be true? Are you me? But why? Just who do you think you are? That's P. What? What do you want with me? I see. You came to accuse me. To blame me for the loss of all those lives. I mean, kinda? You did use the spell. Well then. I shall banish you from my sight! I mean, I'm not saying it was intentional, but you are technically to blame. <laughs> That's right. Witch. Banish her. No. Pour forth your manner and be done with them all. Yes. That shall be my gift. The gift of the White Witch. Wait, is the White Witch cast to appear or not? We have you. Your radiance. Counselors. My beautiful manner can end the world in an instant. <laughs> we need only choose when that instant shall be. We may shape the fate of the world as we will and start afresh whenever we please. That is the power of mine. I hereby call the council to order.
Is the the White Witch some sort of what was that? otherworldly what entity? Just see? Who'd have thought she'd turn out like that? So much for those good intentions. But how could she was there with Cassiopeia? P was there. Cassiopeia is on her own, and she's very, very sad. Well, she has the council with her. Help Cassiopeia. Silence. <gasps> I need nothing. Here the day is ex machina from. Look up there. From the Matrix Revolutions. It's a castle. A castle in the sky. So, little girl, you are stirring up trouble once again. Cassiopeia! Why do you strive to save this fallen world when my radiant manner would start it anew? It's not radiant, it's ashen. You mean... Yes, it is I, the White Witch, arbiter of the fate of the world. It is my decision and my right to bring this world to an end. The judgment has been passed. I have judged you as well. The White Witch. I've judged you to be batshit crazy. Floaty things, swoopy things, and plenty of shooty things. I mean, she's not wrong, but I would expect a bit more decorum from a queen. Not so much that you end up like King Tom, but just a little bit. Also, holy crap, she is big. I'd forgotten how big uh, the, uh, her majesty really is. Jump! Jump! Rest in preparation for the final battle. Yes. Okay, I'm pretty sure uh, this is either going to be the second to last or last episode. Perhaps third to... I don't know. But it's obviously at the tail end of the series. Sky Squealer. Alright. Again, save. You can't be too paranoid, but not when it comes to saving in video games. Oh wait, crap, I should have bought some stuff for my familiars. Oh well. Friends, the time has come! Make ready to assault the lair of the White Witch! Wait, is that the same voice actor as Swain? Because they do sound alike right now. Don't worry, P. It'll work. We'll see. You know, those are actually kind of cool. The, the no little way. buzzards. Grind the cannons! Fire at will! I'm guessing nothing happens because... Oh, never mind. I'll shut my mouth now. Anyone else think this is a bit too easy? It is strange. Why is no one fighting back? I'm going! Me! Wait! I'm coming too! And so am I! But don't oh, wait for me! Hold oh, on! Don't leave the hero behind! The hero is Oliver, Mr. Trippy. Is everybody ready? You're planning to fly through that hail of cannon fire, are you? Would you rather stay here? No, of course not! Wait! Do you have room for another? Because I mean to see this to the very end. Prince Marcus said? Okay, a hop on board. Splendid! Why don't you just bring Queen Lola along? Just We're throw her angry. at the, the, the castle. 
Tell her, I don't know, that the, the white witch is made of cheese. She'll rip that, that witch to shreds. Okay, we're here. The Ivory Tower, Seat of the White Witch. Ugh, all that firepower, not a scratch on it. Just as I thought. It's invulnerable. No matter. The primary purpose of that attack was to unite our forces behind a common cause. Oh. And of course, it just happens yes, to be I war. Might be the case. <laughs> you big liar! You were scared out of your wits. Why was he scared? <laughs> You're clearly hysterical. You guys. Slap him. Esther, slap him. She's ah. waiting for us. The White Witch. I hope when That's she grows up, she'll slap any man who says she's hysterical. Oh, right, I remember this. Alright. Everything's fine here. I see the, the waste stone right there. I'll save two, two slots here, right at the Ivory Tower, but um, I'll keep one from before the Ivory Tower in case I find that I'm underleveled for the umpteenth time and need to grind a bit. Toko so to, to, to Cold. Huh. Twinkle Twinkle, followed by Even Star, she take care of the Toko Toko. And of course, it should be made of a lot of XP. How much XP? 24,000! Christ, that's what... that was three levels, yeah. Enlighten. Boosting magical attack. I don't care about magical attacks, so... Yeah. Refrain, what does that do? Aurora Curialis. Cures their elements. Okay. Obviously, it's going to replace uh, Healing Rain. Orly Jig. Right, let me just check. Um, just to refrain. Boost all allies' defense. Ah, right, should check. No, Cauldron, all the formula. Yeah, see? That was right, Gyro Grappler. Need a blowpipe and some drill screws. I have no idea where to get those, so... Naturally occurring... Tin Man, Impalers, and others. Right. So in theory, I shouldn't actually need to go back to... to grind, I can just find the Tokotokos here. Tokotokolds, in fact. All right, now, see the issue? I mean, that one moved, so it kind of spoiled the surprise, but this is the, uh, the issue. They uh, they look like statues, but they're actually moving, and that's how you can tell that they will attack you. I speak to ice. Okay, yeah, that was actually kind of a waste. You know what? 
Howling Blizzard, bitch. You deal with the wolf now. Holy crap, it's still alive. Okay, that was a waste. We won! Indeed we did. Okay, I'll just heal Marcus in. Oh right, these are also the robots that, uh, that I found, say, at the volcano. Okay, now, time to go. This is a teleporter slash elevator. And now, hey, look at that. One of them is moving. Gee. I wonder why. But you can only tell in first person, see? It's actually kind of funny. <laughs> Alright, let's go. I'm out of my fun. Okay. I'm not too concerned with battling against these guys, so it's whatever. Yes, I remembered that there's a waystone over there. And of course the game does this to your camera just to give you vertigo. I'll still keep th uh, this other save, I don't know. Might be useful. Okay. Huh? What's the issue? Oh! Gallus! That wand. Yeah, remember when I said Mornstar was the most powerful wand? I lied a bit. That's the most powerful wand. Gallus, the power beyond the throne. And the most powerful spell, also not Mornstar, it is the spell associated with that wand. You'll see what it is in short order. I'm pretty sure he's weak to darkness, so. He is not. So that was a complete, complete waste. Is he weak to light? Well, probably not. If he was weak to light, he would be strong against darkness, because that's how these things work. Ah, the glitch! Yeah, he does. Ouch. Healing rain for everybody. Okay, now he's green. So, that means I should eat some fire, I'm guessing. Or is that... No, that's probably electric. Ah. What does electric mean? What? Frostbite? I don't know. No. Haha. <laughs> Maybe it is fire, I don't know. Nope. Okay, I don't think his weaknesses actually change it, just the... Uh, the attack that comes next. Oh, ice. Or water, rather. Wait, I can just do this. And 
There they go. Oh, wait, no. Oh, perfect. Because now we do actually all need to be fully healed. Thank you, Gemma. You're a gem. There's the MP. Frostbite. Oh no, wait, that was... Ah, oh, whatever. I'll just keep using my teeth. I did tell you to defend, man. Oh, wait, that one... I should not have picked up that one. It was for Esther. I have steeled myself. Should have swapped to Gemma. I could just spam Mornstar at him, but I'm pretty sure I'd run out of mana long before he ran out of HP. Not even close. Oh, so it does actually uh, change his resistances. But only while the aura is active. Right, because now he's back to normal. Yeah. Interesting. Why don't you steal yourself, my burning heart? using Everblade or something. It deals decent damage. Yeah. Everblade seems to be the most efficient solution. Just unleash Everblade. Well, I could also compare with the other one. What's the first one? Windfall. Let me see. So the other one was 160-ish. This one... Actually... Okay, that doesn't count because of the... Um... Because of the aura change. I gotta check... Um... With a normal aura. Gimme. Bird. So that's 120-ish for 18, or 160-ish for 21. 
Actually, that seems that seems fine. I could also start using elemental attacks against him when he has the aura. Oh, 200 ish. Okay, he's got a fire aura. So. Now that's Howling Blizzard. Nice try. Wait, did it? The aura disappear just as I was casting? Yes, it did. Screw you, Gallus. Dick. But a guy can't try to exploit your weaknesses. Punish me, huh, Gallus? Well, joke's on you. I'm not into that shit, but I can defend. I think that would be the correct one. Hopefully the aura didn't disappear because he started to cast his spell. It did. Of course it did. Esther, you'd better pick up the other gold glim. Okay, I think she was going for it. Although she seems to be taking the direct line through fire mount. Definitely not advisable if she wants to stay alive. Okay. Yeah, it was about to despawn, so I had to take the risk. There was really no other way. Another one there. I see it. It will not get away from me. Yes. Okay, I could have healed you with that, but fine. Why does she have full MP? Thank you, Mr. Trippy. <clears throat> Why am I getting so many gold glims? Not complaining, but it would be nice to know what I'm doing right so I can do it in other fights. Like, all of them. Okay. Everblade. Braced. Nice. Hang on a second. Give it your all. Yeah, actually attack. Use abilities. Just do something. Thank you. 
I know it, it's just one HP, but whatever. Yeah, that is definitely Swain's VA. Give me that. No! Oh my god, Marcus Sen. Thank you, Marcus Sen. You healed us even though we didn't need much healing. Oh wait, 155. Okay, that's actually a lot. But still, we hardly needed it. And of course it targets me again. Could have ended this by now, Marcus Sen. These hits are all your fault. Gonna make you pay for every single one. Ah, dang it. Well, I suppose I could use Frostbite. Don't tell me, he has a second stage where he's even tougher. Okay. Nope, doesn't seem that way. Also, I remember that I did actually hint that, or after I confirmed that there wasn't even a stronger spell than Mornstar. Although I'm not sure I remember I confirmed the existence of a stronger wand than Mornstar's. Astra. Yeah, I did hint as well that the stick was very important. Yeah, this is the uh, Wizard King. Astra. And not just that, but a spell. I think. But is there no, no spell to come with uh, the wand? Okay. Well, at least now you can compare. 3263 versus 5475. Oh, and of course, this wand here, which has something uh, written there in Nazgan script. I don't remember what it is, and I'm not gonna waste time translating it, but yeah. Hmm. That's a bit barrier, huh? Alright, higher defense still. Okay, for the first time, my magical attack is finally higher than Gemma's. Oh no, wait, even with Aster, it, it was slightly higher. But still, come on, look at that, 253. Although, it's annoying that, as far as I can tell, she doesn't really learn any damaging spells. Damage-dealing spells. So that was annoying. Maybe I should have gone back to save. Oh well. I'm sure it won't go horribly, horribly wrong. On second thought, it might go horribly, horribly wrong, so I'm going back and saving. Oh, also because it's getting late. And I'm getting hungry. Alright, so it's just up there on the left. Okay. 
Maybe it should just be one or two episodes from the end. Well, anyway, that is it for today. As always, thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you again next time.